Hello and welcome to the Bristly Stranger. We are back in Skyshine's Bedlam. There's another dozer in the background. Look at that. Some kind of beast. Looks like it's got some kind of rail cannon on the top, maybe. Uh, in fact, who have we got over here? Ah, it's humans by the look of it. Uh, close combat, sniper and a gunslinger. Excellent. Um, they're, they're looking pretty cool. I think, looking back on when I edited the last video, we can actually play as multiple different races, but obviously we are still just learning at the minute. So why don't we resume our campaign and see how far we can get before we finally crash and burn. So here we are on the map, we've got quite a few crystals, I might just change the meat around. Uh, that was bio research, it's going to cost us 10. Yep, this improves it by 48%. Can we do it again? Yeah, let's do it one more time, 60%. Now hopefully this will be better and we won't suddenly lose out on the others. Um, yeah, let's go for a heal as well. That hasn't actually been a problem so far, but that'll do for now. On which direction we can go? We can actually go to these side bits for an extended mission. It does use a little bit of fuel and a little bit of time, but I think that might be an okay. We might find some more stuff. Let's head to this one. So we are exploring and our attention is drawn by the sound of a nearby battle. So we follow the noises. I'm not sure you really should go towards the noise of battle, but in an area of rubble and derelict buildings, there is a cyborg standing amongst the remains of other cyborgs. Okay, he's chopped them up Let's see what he's got to say for himself. So we get the options. So we can either approach him, attack him, or leave him. Uh, we don't really need any extra crew. Let's see if we can attack him. <laughs> okay, I may be regretting this. Uh, I'm not sure we have got the mocks to take down Samson Nails. He sounds like a little bit of a nutter. He's covered in blood as well. So we've got to choose, uh, we have got our sniper out of action at the minute, heal in three days, that's fine though. Uh, what about the others? Now these, they do more damage but a uh, closer range, I've already got one. Um, don't really want to take close combat if he's close combat, so why don't we take another gunslinger. How about this one? Has he got any XP? No, just one battle. Okay, yeah, he'll do. Let's start off. So, here he is. Um, we are over here. Okay, we have got our energy things. Uh, we can't do either of them. These, I'm not sure, they cost crude and meat. We don't really need them. Let's just move up for now. Uh, same with everyone, really. Really, hopefully we can just stand this side of the wall and blast him from there. Uh, sniper, sniper, our shotgun is slightly faster. Let's put them on the end here. What is he going to do? Wow, he does move quite far. Um, so we've got to move to here with the shotgun to hit him. Three. Okay, he's down to seven. Uh, this gunslinger, move to there we can hit, um, yeah, two, okay, gunslingers don't seem to be anywhere near as powerful, uh, we can move to here and hit with this one though, another two, okay, and he's got three health, I think this one does three or more. Yes, four. There we go. Uh, he wasn't that hard and we got quite a little, well, a little bit of crude and meat and even some power cells. Excellent. So now we have only got, oh, we could go back for these. Do you know what? Let's continue on our course. So up ahead, you see a large trailer towed by a small vehicle. On the trailer, looks like a mobile fusion reactor. 
but it is of dubious design. It comes to a halt and we disembark, and the operator of the fusion towing vehicle exits their cab. Looks like we're going to have a conflab. Hoi, traveller! Such a mighty machine! I bet you those impressive weapons demand loss of power! And as luck would have it, I have power to spare! So we can trade crude for power cells, we can trade meat for power cells, we can trade passengers for power cells. I don't think we're that bothered. Let's leave. I'm probably going to regret this. We continue on our way and leave him behind. Okay, so we've got no options, but we have got some kind of artifact up ahead. Let's go for it. I think we have run into the Crimson King. Ha, you insolent mortars will never locate the mythical Aztec city without the map in my possession. My finest ferocious fighters will stop at nothing to protect it. So we've got to defeat all enemy combats to recover the relic. Okay, that's fine. But who are we going to take? Uh, we have got two gunslingers at the minute, and he's got a couple of kills. No, he's got a couple of kills. He's got one. She's got a couple. You know, we're going to take this guy out. I wasn't overly impressed with the gunslingers. Uh, let's put... One of our close combat guys in. Who do we like the look of? Uh, let's take this beardy guy. Why not? Dens, you're on the team. So, there is some kind of big thing here. Maybe we didn't want to go melee. They are both melee by the looks of it. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to hang back here. Uh, is he a neutral party? I don't think so, actually. Uh, okay, we can move to here and shoot. Four damage. Uh, what is he on now? This is melee. Uh, he is on 21? Surely not. Uh, okay, well, let, let's just wait for now. Let's go with this one. Um, we have to get to there to hit him get to there? Uh, I think so. Let's go to here though. And shotgun three damage. Um, <laughs> surely they're not on that high energy. Uh, we can't actually get them at the minute. Yeah, 18. Blimey. What's this on? 25! Uh, okay, we may be in trouble. Uh, let's move in and give them a whack. Hopefully they don't hit us back. Not for free, okay. Uh, this one is moving. Uh, that's almost one shot us. And he's still very much alive. Um, okay. Let's move with this one. That is in range. Four, right. I don't think they're going down at all this turn. Uh, let's go for this one. Three damage. Maybe we do want to do some kind of strike. We've not got the resources though. Okay, that's fine. Um, with this one, can we do a heal? Uh, recover four health. It's not really worth it. They did eight. Okay, let's just give them a punch. <laughs> Uh, this guy, we are going to move to here. Yeah, that's out of range. Move to there and shoot. Yeah, that's it. They're enraged now. This guy's flopping about. He's dead. Okay, that's fine. Um, we can move to there and shoot the other thing. Let's move to here and shoot the other thing. Uh, the shotgun, we are staying where we are. Five damage. Veteran. Veteran. Excellent. Um, does that mean they get another go? Uh, we're going to move up slightly. We don't want to be that far. In fact, we're going to be a little bit close for the pistols. Uh, oh. oh. 
they vomited on us. Um, we still get another shot. Maybe we should have moved. Uh, we'll move with this guy. Um, that is out. There is still in though. Okay. Um, we want to stay split up a bit. We'll move to there. Maybe three damage. Okay. Another bomb. Another one gone. Okay, we do get extra moves with humans. Really need it. Five. That's a crit. And that's a killer. Okay, that costs us two guys. We've got some meat and crude though. We'll be fine. Bah! The map is worthless without the other powerful items I possess. Your fortuitous performance will not be repeated. The ruthless minions of King Viscera will not fail to protect my remaining relics. Okay, he's not the Crimson King. I think that's something from Stephen King. But we have acquired a map to Bedlam. Excellent. We kind of get a choice of where to go. I think we go in this direction to head back to here. I didn't really realise that we were heading away from it. But, you know, that's fine. Let's go to that one. So, Dozer travelling along, slows as we enter an area that was populated long ago. We have to steer between crumbling buildings, but up ahead we spy a group of Bedlam dwellers signalling for our attention. Some of them are wounded. Sounds like a trap to me. Dozer comes to a halt, we get out, the Bedlam dwellers approach and we're relieved... Oh, and they're relieved to see us. Excellent. Grats for stopping. Struf, we didn't know how many more suns we could last. Group of Borgs got the meaners. Been footing after us since they found our supply of sparkers. Okay, whatever that is. Could you provide sanctuary for us in your amazing rig? We rightly offer up our power cells in Haggle. What say? Uh, yep, power cells, fine, get aboard. Thousand grats, those sparkers are better served in your hands. Yep, I agree. So everyone gets aboard, a few more passengers, that means our meat's going to not last quite as long. We should get some more sparkers. Yep, ten more power cells, sixty-seven more passengers, yep, that's fine. So we could get to here and look for some more guys. Do you know what? I'm going to take one detour route to try and get some more meat. After wandering through a rocky canyon, our crew comes across a derelict building and find themselves facing a rather irritable group of cyborgs. They're not even thinking about negotiating, they are firing. You footed into the wrong territory, Chumbo. You're not marauders but you look hostile enough to me. Nice gun. Okay, so we lost two guys. Uh, we've got a level up here though. Um, how, how do we do our level ups? Uh, oh, I see, I think we can just add to here. So more damage. Uh, is that everything? It looks like. Uh, can we come over here? No, that doesn't seem to do anything either. Okay, we've got another level up with this one. It's the shotgun. Uh, I'm going to go for damage again. Uh, we have got the shotgun and the sniper. Yeah, we lost our close combat guy. Looks like our gunslinger actually survived. Um... Have we got anyone that's got some kills? No. Uh, okay, let's take him out again. Uh, I think our melee guys got a hard time last time. Let's take the other one out and have a look. So we have got a couple of guys, 10 and 11 health. Gunslinger and a close combat guy. Okay, uh, let's just move up then. Move up to here. Uh, melee. We want them kind of in the way. Uh, 
shotgun. I've got to get nice and close. Gunslinger, let's move you over here. How close are they going to get? Uh, quite close. Okay. It's some kind of exclamation mark thing. Um, that is in range there. Okay. Take a blast. Uh, this one is not going to get there. So let's stand in front and protect that one. Can we do any kind of defense? No, it doesn't look like it. Maybe that's a special ability. The shotgun can't get up yet. Okay, let's move to here. We'll stand too close to that. Uh, and same with the pistol. We'll just move up a little bit. Now I've just realised we're quite bunched up. Hopefully they're not going to grenade us. Okay, our close combat has been hit. Um, let's get our gunslinger. Move them to here. We can get a shot. Yep, three left. Um, how much damage do we do with this one? Is it four? In that case, let's move to here and chop them. It's only two. Okay, in that case, uh, we'll move to right next to them and blast them. Got a bit close again. Um, okay, let's move over here. Uh, and a little bit more in this direction. They're coming in now. Shooting our close combat. They've been hit a couple of times. Okay. Uh, move to here. Get a shot. Sniper. Oh, they're shooting back. Of course. Uh, we can hit there though. Eight damage. Lamb. And yep. Meat and crude. Bye bye to the cyborgs. Okay, so that got us a little bit. Our crude and our meat are up a little bit. Let's have another run and see what we run into this time. So this is sounding familiar. Dozer drives over something buried in the rows. Noisy discharge, it's an EMP mine. And it looks like we're being attacked by the rogue AI. This is the first time we've seen a repeat. We haven't seen much though, so it might repeat itself. It doesn't matter too much, we're fighting some AI. This gunslinger, they're out for three days. Let's put our other one in. Uh, let's take them out seven days. Uh, do you know what? I kind of like the shotgun guys. Let's put our other rookie in. Yeah, that sounds fine. So I'm fairly certain that there is some kind of rock, paper, scissor thing where you know, Gunslinger is best against something else and such. You get the idea. Until I figure it out, we are just going to carry on moving forward. Looks like... Oh, there are two of them. Okay. That's fine. I thought it was only going to be one. It's a Gunslinger and a Shotgun. So they're super short range. Uh, can we get anywhere close? No. Um, let's move up. Uh, this guy can't get into range. Uh, this one can, but that's moving to move, I think. I don't know. Let's try it out. No, it's only one. Okay, we can shoot this guy. He is going to shoot back, though. Of course he is, and he's doing more damage. Right, let's move this one up. And let's move this one up and shoot. Uh, this one can't shoot. We're just out of range. I'm going to leave it there then. This one, we can move up to there. Um, let's end turn at that. Okay, five damage from that shotgun. Shoot back here though, okay, that's fine. They're on five now. Uh, let's blow them away with a shotgun. Uh, 
got to get to there. Okay, that'll do. Not quite killed them. And that's shooting back. One left. Okay. The gunslinger can kill them. There we are. The sniper. Um, can't quite get close enough by the looks of it. Are we going to lose another one? Okay, let's move up. This one... Yeah, we are... This is just the rookie. Okay, let's just blast them. Uh, there we go. We've lost one as well. Um, who could do with the kill? Probably this one. Yeah. They're on one health. There we go. And the robots also had some meat and some crude. Okay. That's fine, that'll top us up a little bit. And we have only got one direction we could go in, there is no events. I think we'll take this, this might be the last one though. Dozer, it's travelling along, it slows as it enters an area with rubble and machinery. Either side of the road is tall tech totems. They have got a high yield plasma barrier, I think we've also seen this one. Looks like another fight. Yep, they're teleporting in and attacking us. Okay, that's fine. So we've got a couple of guys out and we did lose another one. Uh, we'll take this one out then. And take this one out. We can put a shotgun back in. Uh, we can put our sniper there back in. Uh, let's take this one. Yeah, that sounds fine. I'm not sure what we need. So we have got uh, three and some of them are melee. Okay, uh, we will move up a little bit. I don't want to move too far. Uh, same with this one. Um, try and keep them together a little. Let's move to there. Uh, cover didn't seem to matter. See if it does though. Okay, he's got to get in close combat. Eleven health, and they're bimbling around a little bit. Um, okay, do you know what? We have got a lot of power. Shall we do one of these? Four tiles, twelve damage. No, let's save it. Uh, we can move to here and shoot that one. Yeah, that's fine. Only three damage. Uh, move to here and shoot that one. Five. Um, that is in range. That's three. Yeah, let's go there. Take that one down. Okay, four. And that leaves only this one. That is in range, though. Okay. Uh, this is going to do two damage. That is fine. Uh, that's three damage. That's less fine. Okay. Um, let's concentrate on the shotgun. Uh, can we actually get a shot on him? Yeah, just there. Five. Okay, uh, it's only got four. This one should be able to take them out if I can. Yeah, there's a good place. Excellent. Uh, okay, so the shotgun guy will move back. Blast. Three damage. Um, the gunslinger. Can we hit from there? Yeah. Don't think this cover will help versus me. One damage. That helped. Uh, okay, he's chucked a thing at us. That's fine, though. Uh, we can move to here and shoot. Two damage. Uh, three left. Uh, let's just shoot here. Five damage all over. Uh, yeah, a bit more meat, more power cells, more crude. Excellent. Okay, so I'm not really sure what the robots use the meat for. Probably for trading. I've just noticed on the side thing. This thing wasn't uh, an extra passenger, it's actually an elite battle. Uh, 
uh, defeat them, they join your crew. So, yeah, it might be a battle, it might just be people joining. There are lots of options around us, and there's a big cache of crude ahead. Uh, we do want to go and get that artifact over there, but we are going to leave that for next time. It seemed to be this time we got combats nearly every single time. Last time it was a little bit more story driven, we did see some repeats as well. Obviously with the random nature of games like this you're bound to get a little bit of repeating. Our threat level is still low but it's moving into guarded, not sure what that means either. I'm going to have to try and find out what the difference between the different characters are. If one's better against another, that's obviously good information to know. But I'll try and work that out before next time. If you have enjoyed the episode, do leave those likes, and it's always great to hear from people, so drop any comments you have to say in the comments below. And of course, subscribe to keep up to date with the videos. But for now, I've been the Bristly Stranger, thanks for watching, and goodbye.